Hello everyone, I'm ready for another adventure. It's me, Wookie, and I'm back with another fake Android video. I'm joined with my brother, Nux. Hello. And we're continuing down our challenge of challenges and challenges you class exactly one time. Currently, we are one in five. <laughs> Not been good, but we did beat this one, which I'm proud of still. What, which one are we going to do? We're going to be doing Revival Suites Universe. We have exactly one shot at this. We only got one shot at this. So let's go and find it. Pie shorts? No, I need to find my brother. Find no his time list. For pie. I have no time there for you nugs. Know. There he is. So here we go. Let's see his support setup. We have uh, Abigail. Abigail here to give out hot dogs. And then we have VB. I looked at my brother directly to see if he was going to make another weenie joke. No, he did not. I did not. No weenie joke. Just a weenie delicious joke. hot dog. She wants to eat. To be fair, on your screen it's random, but for me it's always on the regular form of Abby. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's such a random for everyone else but me. That's funny. Uh, we got BB here with the 200% care. We got Morgan holding the skull. And we got Gil... Uh, I was going to say Gilgamesh. That is not Gilgamesh. That is Gils the Reyes. That caster. is Gilgamesh. We are back in Gilfest. <laughs> yeah, we are back in Gilfest. And he's here with the BB slot because he's not... BB is not holding the BB slot. She can't. This time. She needs to hold the team. She needs to hold the team. You know what? I like that move. I'm gonna go over here. So here we go. Here's what our strategy hint. The snack meister will have very high HP after their HP is broken, but you can defeat them much more easily if you can defeat as many of other enemies as possible before breaking their gauge. Each turn the snack meister will defeat an enemy and apply a both a buff and a debuff to themselves. Figure out which enemy they'll defeat will be crucial to winning this battle. What? So Snackmeister will have very high, sorry, after the HP is broken, but you can defeat them much more easily if you defeat as many of the other enemies as possible before breaking their gauge. Each turn, a Snackmeister will defeat an enemy. She's so basically, we have, them. yeah, we have to, she's going to choose one of them. Yeah. Okay. All right, Toon Squad. We just have to try and kill the other enemies before she does. Okay. I'm going to pick this unit. Because this is the only chance I'm ever going to use her. And so many people keep saying she's good. We're going to go in with Yang, who has 10, 10, 10 skills now. Whoa! Fully built out Yang. Whoa! I've listened to the comments. It's finally her time. Potentially. <laughs> her time. Alright, boy. Who are you going to pick for the other? Damn. I don't know. I'm not sure. Uh, let's go with Casters. Alright, we'll go with Casters. What about Tababo? Tomomo? Okay. We'll bring in Tomomo. Give her her check ready. And then we'll go in here. Mm, let me see. In case this all falls apart, we should have maybe a foreigner. But do I have a foreigner is another good question. You probably do. Oh, I, I'm using a foreigner. You're using a foreigner right now. You know what? You also have... Abby Summers. I, I literally can't pick Abby because she would kill our budget, I think. She would kill our entire setup. But this is our only chance to potentially shine. It is her only time to shine. You know, maybe it's time. I'm going to see. Put her Zero in. skills. Zero skills? MP2? MP2. Zero buffs. It's peak. It's peak. Alright, who do you want to add here? Uh, I'll try to lower the rarity. Since it's a berserker... I'm having a little hope, so let's put in Koo. Alright, alright, Koo. Koo, Koo, Koo. And then we'll go for M.A.S.H. Special class. Well, I don't think she can wear the, the thing. She cannot, but it's fine. We'll give her the Secret Company Assassin. That's good enough. And we'll go in with this team. Potential! There's slightly more synergy here than most other teams. So maybe we got a shot here. I like BB's support. And she can give some attack. Sounds like we're going to be fighting multiple enemies, so it might be good with her AoE. We'll see. Sweets universe. A pen, a pen skill 1 level 2. It's true. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Power. It's about drive. It's about power. Fatal battle. Okay. Ooh. Not bad. Okay. So let's see. Complete by defeating the Snake Master. We won't know which one she's going to go for. But I feel like when we kill one, she's going to go for the other. Yeah, Art's shaved. I feel mm. like her getting the snowman would be pretty bad. Just yeah. because he's a higher rarity. He is a higher rarity. 
Let's see, is there any way we can potentially go in for some BB loops? We I forgot Tamamo doesn't get 50%. She does not fine. get 50%, but that's fine. Mm. I think we can go BB then and go start with the shaved one. Okay. And we'll bring down the sun. Go ahead. Okay. Do we want to set up her uh, taunts, or is it only for a single turn? She has a, she has a taunt? She does. Uh, but I think her taunt is only, like, to men, if I remember correctly. Uh, What's the sun? We should wait for that when we actually use her to attack. I thought she had a taunt. Applying physical security for each turn. Target again. focus is right there. Okay, target focus. Okay, so we'll, we, we can save it for now. We'll go here. You. We'll go you. here. Go here for what? Because why not? Uh, That's what they thought when they were making that skill. Why not? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and then we'll go here, and we'll go for her, him first. Let's go for the big, big, dead. Yeah, he's dead. Let's hope that she was gonna pick him. <laughs> Art's up. Well, that's useless on her. <laughs> well, Damn it. Bad. Got defense. Not bad. All right. All right. All right. She is a single target, so it actually would be good to keep Yang alive as quickly as possible. She eats, and she gets a buff and a debuff. That's the thing. Okay, let's see. Snack effect, skill seal. When HP reaches zero, skill seal turns zero on whoever defeated you. Oh, so dicey. So that would be... When HP increases the buster card effectiveness on whoever defeated you. So that means we want her to eat this one. Yeah. Okay, so we'll go here. Go with BB. Once we're, again. We're gonna buff out BB. This is the BB buff. Yes. Yahoo! Go here. It's guaranteed to let her do eat. The same thing. Yeah, let her eat this guy. I think she'd like this guy. <laughs> we'll see. Thanks. Sugar. She eats some. Skill seal. Dang Good. Dang. That's not permanent, though. That sucks. Yeah, that is a little unfortunate, but it's fine. Oh, there's two good ones. I think we AOE here. I think we should AOE here. Let's see, what does it do? When HP rate increases with whoever defeated you. Increase the charge of whoever defeated you. Okay, okay, and then we can go here, and I think we can actually go use this skill. So we can buff her up a little bit. Okay. Should we use this actually for healing on Tamamo? Yeah, I think so. Okay. It's a nice chunk. Okay, so we'll see. The thing I don't... is, we're going to be completing the dark for whoever comes in to replace them. It's true. I'm going to go for here and see. Should we try and make it so that this one attacks strongest first, and then use this, and then go for this? Yeah. Okay. Just be careful. Should be fine. Alright. I don't think it's going to be enough, unfortunately. It might be. We'll see. I should have chosen which one was better based off of what how strong this skill was. He, he is here. Damn. Just barely. But it's alright. She can eat the treasured manju, I guess. The NP up. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, in theory, as long as we can hold oh, it. She, she doesn't. She didn't eat it. So there's a chance that she eats it. Okay. Critical up and HP recover. When HP reaches zero, critical strength increases the star gain for... Recover HP, whoever defeated you. Okay. I think we go with uh, Yang yeah. to defeat that one. I think I'm also going to use her skills now, just so she can get the focus in. And I think this one is... It's uh, defense down. No, decrease the charge and gain MP corn to the amount decrease, so I can go here. Keep her from doing her MP, actually. Yep. This one will make it so that when they attack it, it'll be bad. Okay. Then we'll go here, here. That is a full arts. Well, it is. I'm really gonna have to be hopeful that she does not go for this one. God damn it. Of course she goes for that one. Yeah. Oh, big boy. That is a big boy. God damn, he's huge. Uh, when HP is retreats maximum, whoever defeated you. Okay, so we don't want to actually attack him, so we're going to attack this one. Okay. Um, Can we kill it? I think we better to guarantee kill it. Yeah. And let her eat the big jumbo man. The jumbo man. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. She starts freaking the hell out. Wait, wait. 
Imagine she goes, damn. Doesn't get all that kill. back. Yeah, it's not gonna kill. I have to actually hope that she chooses to increase it, choose to eat it, it eats it now. Please eat it now. Yes! yes. Perfect. No. That's not perfect. It's not good. Ouch. That's also very bad, but it's alright. Just because we gave her that crit buff. That's the only reason. Yeah. We have to make her eat the heavenly dango. You think? Okay, let me see. When HP reaches uh, who, uh, inflict death on whoever defeated you and increased uh, the hit rate if the snack master defeated you. Okay, so literally don't kill it. Quick. Okay. Turns. Can you heal? Can Tomo even kill it here though? Yeah. I think anyone can kill it here. She has 100% of the attack thing up. Okay. So theor theoretically, <laughs> if she misses lethal, I don't know how that happened. Alright, let's see. Don't underestimate how weak casters are. I'm not, under I'm not underestimating her because it was only 20. Alright. And she's Smack 90. Foot. Perfect. Yeah, only was permanent. That goes BB, unfortunately. Down goes my girl. It's alright, though. She was helping out at the Snack beginning. Goes there goes Tomomo. Snackmeister. Slowly but steadily, she is eating all of this. She is. Let's see what that, uh, mob, freaking mob dude does. Okay, let's see. When HP reaches zero, apply HP recovery per turn, five turns, increase defense on whoever. Defeat you. Hmm, okay. And this one is obviously increase arts card's effectiveness on whoever defeated you. Okay, then I think we can have Yang kill her then. Okay. Or kill it, I should say. And hope to God that Q does not kill with this. It was close. I do a lot of damage. I'm cool. Okay. Thank cool, cool, cool. Thank you. Eat, eat. Yes. Damn. Stop. That might be it. Oh, no, not it. 100 per turn? What? She gets 100 per turn. For this? Yeah. Yeah, this doesn't mean anything because her defense is down by a huge amount. Uh, I think we, we can go to just kill her then, though. If her <laughs> defense is that down. Uh, increased critical rate of whoever. You think so? I guess we can do it now. I mean, there's eight still left to go, but if you think we can go for it now, we'll go well, for it now. I'm only saying it because you said her defense is hella down. All right. So I'm we'll try. I, I'm i curious to see how low... I assumed if you can get all the units in there, but to be honest, we're starting to run out of dudes. Yeah, we're slowly losing units, which is why I was like, yeah, we should probably go for the kill. Yeah. Or at least take 200, down... 200,000 is not bad for the start here. Or take down her first bar. Yeah. Just to see how it goes, yeah. And I just hope to God that she chooses the neg negative one. She did not. She did not, but that's fine. Ow. We forgot to put on Ku's thing. No, I didn't. <laughs> oh, we did it? I sure didn't. That was just naturally how fucking strong she is. Um, There's two negatives, so. <laughs> yeah. We can put her to sleep, or try to. And attack the others, I guess. We can put the other ones to sleep. That's true. I'll put this guy to sleep. Does this affect the party or only one person? For a single enemy, okay. I'm asleep. Okay, you're asleep now. I'll attack in with Ku. I'm Ku. Margin Ku. Margin Ku. And have to just hope that she eats one of these dudes. Please. She NP'd. I forgot about that. So there goes one of them. Oh, she went for Abby. <laughs> yeah, well this is the least hurdy of all of them because she still has the guts. And she has not uh, She takes less they damage. just didn't kill her. <laughs> God, how much HP did she recover? 100, I told you. 100, 100 or 100,000? 100, 100,000. Oh, then there was no chance for us to kill her. We should never have gone for it. Yeah, but... That's all we can do. Yeah, now it is. Increase MP or charge to whoever defeated you. 
So if she kills that thing, that's she bad. Gets her NP, yeah. That's annoying. That's fine. But the thing is that they're all going to be targeting her now. Yep. Okay. Then I'll go here. Start attacking. I don't think I can do 200,000, 100,000 at once, but I can at least. If you didn't crit. If you crit, yeah. Even on her best days, that's not really what she's focused on. That fully healed her. That sure did. All of these are negative now, right? Quote unquote negatives. Apply charm to whoever defeated you. Alright, let me hit her with this. Full Abigail Smith. Can I increase this? Yeah, just by a little bit. She got stunned. Nice. She did get stunned, I'll be damned. I can try and inflict fear. They all got terrored. I don't know, it might stun them. We'll see. Funny enough, Ab Abigail scales are actually kind of coming in handy here where we don't actually want to kill anyone. Yeah, 200,000. Excitement. There she goes. There she goes. But now we have another. Akoo's thing's back up. It is, but this is still here for a single turn, I think. One, One left on two turns. I don't know, it's probably still good to activate it, actually. Activate heal. Go here, so I can get my big old buff. Activate here. And then just go here. And just basically wall up and let her kill these two. Let's see. She's, She's charmed now. So that means we have free reign on this one, though. Which one is this one? It's a quick card. Uh, quick card, sure. Just be careful. Dreamland is AOE. So I can go here and then go here. I don't think that's going to do much, but at least that will give us a slight defense. Heal all wounds. Doesn't heal. Yeah, it doesn't heal, you're right. <laughs> she does say, I'll heal all your wounds, and then doesn't proceed to heal any wounds. 69, please don't. Oh, she's charmed. That's right, that's fine. She can't attack right now. Okay, so we're just gonna so go... So here's the bad thing. Yeah? We kill that, we kill the other dude. <laughs> but he does give us a full MP charge. does give us a full MP charge, but you would want that on MASH. Probably. Okay. So I think I'm or gonna you go... could Dreamlands and it goes to Abby, but she dies. I think we'll go here. I think this is the least chance of actually killing the boar. Now this also does mean that she's gonna have a full NP and just destroy us. Yes. So go here. Snack up, quick up, thank you. Would have been nice to go to Koo, but that's not how life works. There it goes. And then she's gonna NP somebody. And we just have to hope that it is a uh, coup. It's coup. Cool. Yeah, it's coup. Cool. All right, not bad. Cross We're almost at the at the end of it. We're two more, yeah. Intuition. Remove buff. That's annoying. That is very annoying. That's the reason why she was able to hold on for so long, huh? Fool. Let's rip it up. I think we can kill this one. Attack. What's the other one? The other one is inflict burn to whoever defeated you. So yes, go here and go for the gay bulge. Go for the gay bulge. And hope to God that we don't kill the other thing by accident. Of course, Abby gets 100% on her one singular quick card like a fucking troll. I should do a lot in theory. Okay, this should be enough to kill him but not actually kill the other thing, which is what we want. There we go. Oh, it was really good that we got that crit. Yes. It's gonna be real funny when we attack her and she's still... It's not gonna be enough for us to kill. Yeah. I feel like we should increase the health of Abby. Because she's doing really good right here. Yeah. She's Fully. living. Yeah, so we're gonna trust in Abby. 
Um, Trust in Abby. We can't use her MP, right? What do you mean? Abby's MP we can't use at the moment. Not yet. Okay, so I think I'm going to go for here and go for a, a try and get a full rotation of mash. Oh, damn. I didn't think about the idea that maybe she lived this. She doesn't have bonus damage against preservers. You know that. I know that, but I didn't think that she would live it. Now she gets free reign on Abby. That's yeah, a little bit annoying for sure. Ooh, we get this. And then this lasts for how much longer? His guts? Yeah. Three more. Really? Three more turns? Okay, we can risk it for three more turns, I think. Actually, no, we can... Fuck it. I'll give him the slight heal, because why not? Uh, or the lulls, as they say. Yeah. Give him a little bit of buff. Let's see how much it is. In the end? So, we just lose here, correct? Because <laughs> we didn't break her thing, and now she has nothing to eat to lower her stuff. No, I thought it was no, the... I think that was the thing. No, I thought it was... Hunger meter, after a certain number of turns, apply out of energy. Tremendous decrease to HP per turn. Oh, okay. After a certain number of turns, apply out of energy. Tremendous decrease HP every turn. So if we just actually make her go to bed, will that just help us? Yeah, probably. Become stuns for two turns. All right. Well, she'll just wake up after you attack her. But not if I use this as the final one, right? For Dreamlands? Yeah. Okay. I'll go here, here. Yeah, if we actually just put her to sleep, that's different. Because then that means that we won't have to attack her for... She won't attack us for a single turn. And then that's it. She didn't fall asleep. Damn. That's, uh, that's it for Abby, then. Nope, never mind. There goes his guts, though. He's dead. Yeah, he's dead. 1,000 each turn. The one who will guard. Well, Abby, this is how you die. Look at the bright side. I really feel like we actually missed that completely and should have just ordered her down or something. I don't understand how it said, like, her H... I thought it was dependent on how much her HP is. But now I have to look up and see, because I feel like we were just told the opposite. Right there. No. I'm going to go to the one that actually tells me. I'm just going to go to Game Press and see what it says to do. And that will tell me whether or not you were supposed to actually attack the things. Uh, exhibition quests... Go to... It's a coil one that's... It's not Mega Coil 2020, Mysterious Heroin X Altar. Uh, yeah, those are the victim blights that serve to the final blow. Um, the quest is largely unchanged from the original The Guide. Buckle down, buddies. This is probably the longest challenge quest in the series, an eating contest of endurance. Of series. There are three types of enemies that are completely safe to eat. Kill some buffs, will have caveats, and avoid a sacrifice. It's okay to not steal all the buffs. This is difficult, and letting some slide may be a better play. For the most part, the monsters will give the same effect to the player, must serious enemy with some exception. Every turn, serious enemy X will attempt to eat another monster unless she uses her NP, skilled, sealed, or disabled. Pre-break, she will eat them. Post-break, Mysterio has a hunger counter where she will lose 2 million HP each turn after it runs out. It starts at 17 turns and reduces by 1 for each buff that player kill. We were at turn 19. We just didn't have enough survivability. We sure did not have enough survivability. Most players clear the CQ with 3 phases to the strategy. Phase 1, try to steal as many safe buffs as possible. Phase 2, break her bar before she can kill the enemies that will charm stun optional. Oh, because after you do that, then that means she'll just get it? Yeah, she'll just be standing there and install it out. Brute Force, using a servant with a strong single-target looping and crit potential will allow them to just focus on stairs as, for as much as possible. This is called Good Card RNG and Killing the Stone Golem Turn 1 in order to prevent from gaining the 5-turn def defense buff. So Although, we were supposed to stop her from eating that golem. Yeah, we did. We did not stop her from eating that golem. But to be fair, it was a 50-50 about which one she was going to eat first. Yeah. Uh, huh. 
Shooting Stone Golem. Stone Golem is necessary for Brute Force, Rush Strats. Snowman 1, go for it. Low HP, strong HP. Kill if possible. Team composition. Yeah, this is just one of those ones where it's just really long. There was no... I don't know. The way it seemed, we got plenty of them killed, and it seemed like we just got punished by a max 10 million HP. Yeah. So, it is... That's another, again, it's another one of those quests where it's like, yeah, you have more time and you actually bring it down. Because I feel like our strategy was working. Yeah. But one shot, that was it. Alright, everyone. Uh, Yang did a little bit better there than I thought she would. I'll yeah. say that much. Yang seemed to be holding up pretty well. Summer Abbey, funny enough, did pretty okay for that one, too. Which helped that there was a lot of berserkers. And you're in a very specific fight where actually, hey, maybe you want to stop them from attacking. I think it was if we had. I think if we had actually gone with Castoria instead of Tomo, I think we would have been able to beat it. Because I think the thing that was actually holding us back was the fact that we couldn't get fifty percent NP to BB on turn one. Yeah, we should have probably won Castoria. Yeah, I mean, we had already used Castoria, so the right move here for the more fun thing is to try and use other servants. But either way, end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. We'll be back for the final one of this specific uh, year. Which is going to be 2022. Say goodbye, boy. Goodbye. Peace out.